And new this evening, parents who lost their children to gun violence calling for change. News 12's Jericho Tran joins us from City Hall with why community members are saying lawmakers have the blood of those lost on their hands. Yeah, Phil, blood that people here say needs to stop spilling in the streets as a result of gun violence. Now, the rain did not stop concerned parents and community members from calling for help after they say the city is turning into the Wild West. These guns are killing our kids. We need someone to help us. We need a savior. The New York City Safety Coalition is setting up right in front of City Hall to get one clear message out. We definitely need more safety officers in school to protect our kids. We need more police officers on the streets to protect our communities, protect our streets. The issue of gun violence now amplified by the deaths of several teens over the past few weeks, three of which were only 16 years old. Unfortunately, those young deaths are only a few from the past years of gun violence that have claimed the lives of far too many. This is like the worst pandemic. Forget about coronavirus. Killing, shooting is the worst pandemic that we have right now in New York 16. Today, many are asking why people now walk the streets in fear, why gangs freely patrol the streets, and why children can't play in parks safely. Questions they are demanding not only answers for, but change as well. The legislature, including Assembly Speaker Call Hasty from the Bronx, which is ground zero, the epicenter of gun violence, as well as um, State Senator Andrea Stewart Cousins because we need them to fix their mess. Because of them, young people, fathers, community members are dying and the blood is on their hands. Now today's call comes just days after city council members gathered right here to call on Governor Hochul to reform state laws in order to keep individuals found with illegal guns off the streets. In City Hall, Jericho Tran, News 12.